accuracy. The Earth was spinning on its axis while also hurtling through space in its orbit around the Sun. The Moon, their target, was also a moving object, orbiting the Earth at over 2,000 miles per hour. The task was like trying to throw a dart from a moving carousel to hit a moving target on another distant carousel. If the launch angle was too shallow, the Apollo spacecraft would ricochet off Earth's dense upper atmosphere, skipping back into space like a stone on a pond lost forever. If the angle was too steep, the friction would be too great, and the command module would incinerate upon re-entry, becoming a man-made meteor streaking across the sky. Once in space, the challenges only multiplied. The path to the moon was not a straight line. It was a complex curving trajectory shaped by the competing gravitational pulls of the Earth, the Moon, and even the Sun. The spacecraft was in a constant state of falling, first falling away from the Earth, then falling towards the Moon. The calculations had to predict this gravitational hand